We're in Windows 2012 R2, and I'm going to show you how to join a server to a domain. It's very similar to joining uh, a regular computer to a domain. Let's go ahead and open up Control Panel, click on System, and from here we can see the name of the computer or the server, and it's in a work group, which is by default. We click on Change Settings, and we see that we have the option to rename the, the server or join it to a domain. Let's go ahead and join it. And make sure that you put in the fully qualified domain name, not just the NetBIOS name. So you got to have the .local, .internal, whatever it is. And at this point we get prompted for the username and password. Alright, so we've entered that. And let's see if we can get successfully joined to the domain. Usually takes a few seconds, sometimes takes a little longer. Depends on how fast your computer is and the, the, how fast the connection is to the domain itself. We should get a message here in just a couple of seconds. It says, welcome to the domain. And then we'll need to restart our server. When we log back in, we'll want to log back in with the NetBIOS domain name. So you don't need the whole .local, .internal, just the first name backslash and then whatever administrator name you need all right so it says we are welcome to the domain and now we're going to go ahead and get prompted here for a reboot in just a second there we are must restart and restart now